Hello everyone, and welcome! In this video, I'll teach you how to use design to create consistent character images and videos with AI, demonstrating features like consistent character, character sheets, and AI video to create character animations. How to use design to fully implement your script from start to finish. Create your first customized character animation. Let's get started now. First, create a project. We need to generate some multi-angle, solid background images of the main characters. Enter your prompt. At this stage, there's no need to describe each angle. Just focus on describing the character's appearance. You can try out different character styles in the style library until you find the one you want. Next, you need to process the generated images. Crop each image individually into a single character image to improve the quality of the consistent character generation. Since my generated images all have white backgrounds, I used a blank canvas to adjust the image ratio. At this point, you can also use AI Eraser, Local Edit, and other features to refine the character details. The key points to creating a good character sheet are clear and consistent character details, multiple angles, and clean backgrounds. Keeping these three in mind will significantly optimize your workflow. Step two, click on consistent character. Upload the image you just created, name your character, and click generate. Then, wait for your character to be created. Don't forget to adjust the animation aspect ratio you want to generate. The key points for writing a consistent character prompt are covered in detail in previous videos, so be sure to check them out. The final step, generate AI video. There are three video models to choose from, Standard, Kling 1.5, and Minimax Haluo. Select the video model that suits your needs. Then enter a concise prompt describing the character's movements. There's no need to describe the character's features at this stage. Finally, click Generate to create the AI video. Keep in mind that AI video generation may have some errors, but you can always refine the final result through post-editing.